down screen coming. You cannot go up the gut this way. You've got to go this way and chase off Durant's hip. Going up the gut is never something you can do. Now look, now he's got you perfectly fronted, and now it just turn and shoot right over you. Can't guard like this. Your back needs to be to the baseline, not the sideline. When your back's to the sideline, you're asking to get beat back door, which is exactly what happens, and it leads to an easy nets too. What is Jalen Brunson doing here? You cannot be in the paint when your man is here. Obviously, you have no chance of getting back to the three-point line then. Have to defend this down screen. Get attached to your man, arms out so that this player can't curl. He curls. Now you can't guard this dribble handoff. And now look, now that's getting the defense in scramble mode, and it leads to a Nets 2. Stagger screen right here. The Nets are setting. You go under this first screen, over the second one. When you go over the first one, look at the separation. Way too much separation. Now that draws a double team and an open Nets 3. Have to do something about this down screen. You've got to get attached to your man and your arms out so Durant can't curl. He curls, so now you can't guard this dribble handoff without a second defender, and it leads to an easy Nets, too. It's total laziness on Julius Randle's part. There's no ex- If you sprint back, look what happens now. You're sprinting so this player can go here, but you're jogging, so now this player's got to take your man, and it leaves the corner, of course, wide open for three. Don't lean towards the screen. Watch this Knicks defender here. Look at him lean towards the screen that way. So now Kevin Durant just refuses it, gets right into the lane, and shoots right over you. There is no reason for Julius Randle to not just step over the screen. You are walking into your own screen. Look at that. So now Kevin Durant's open for three. Why is this big for the Knicks coming to double here? Look at this. This Derrick Rose is doing great one-on-one. You coming to double now means that this player's got to occupy your man while you go to double for no reason. And now, of course, this player's wide open. Just rip and go right into the lane for two. Just laziness from Julius Randle. Sprint back, please. Look at you jog and jog. So now you can't get over to Seth Curry, who's just going to blow right past you. Now the defense is in scramble mode, and it's going to end up leading to an easy Nets uh, wide open three eventually. Why is Julius Randle opening up his hip? Look at this. Look at how his hips open to where there's no help. This player needs to drop. Flip your hips and force him into help. Okay? But you're just allowing him to go away from any help. So there you go. And one. Not switch a ball screen like this. Look at the separation between the player switching onto the ball handler and the screener. You got to get up and ready to guard. You're not up and ready to guard. Open three. Kevin Fournier, on the airtime of this pass, you need to be up guarding Seth Curry right here. This is Seth Curry, okay? You're standing way too far back, man. Okay, Jalen Brunson has got to just stay attached to this player's hip and chase. Why is that? This player needs to get attached with his arms out. That forces this player out so this chase can happen. Instead, Jalen Brunson is going over the down screen before Joe Harris, so now he's just going to beat him back door for two. This is how you get beat right here. So look at this. This Knicks player is going to put the ball through his legs. He's not moving anywhere. Yet watch this Knicks player's feet. Ball goes through his legs. He hasn't moved anywhere. Yet look at your feet. You're moving your feet. That's how you get blown by for a layup. Cannot triple team Kevin Durant right here, okay? This player is perfectly in help side. Jalen Brunson, go to a body. Everything is fine. But instead, you're tripling Kevin Durant which just leaves everybody too open, so it's rip and go to the lane for two. Not gamble guarding Kevin Durant. Watch this player right here. Let's take a peek. There's your gamble right there. That's how you get crossed over in an easy uh, jumper. You have to guard this down screen, okay? This player here has got to get attached to his man, arms out, so this player can't curl right off of it. He's able to curl right off it. Look at the space now. So now you're done. Now this player's in the lane, drawing help, and it just leads to a rip-and-go drive as the defense is in scramble mode for two. How does Jalen Brunson fall asleep on his man like this? Look at this. What is Jalen Brunson doing? You're here. Your man is here. Of course you have no chance to guard him now. And it's just right to the rim, draw help, dunk.
Cannot get back to the middle of nowhere on defense, okay? This is getting back to no man's land. Get to a body because the person you're supposed to be guarding is about to set a ball screen that you're in no position to defend, so it's an and one. Cannot sag off Kevin Durant like this. You've got to get up in his grill. Look at this. I have a player ready to help me right here, so force him there, okay? You sag off Durant. He's just going to shoot right over you. Look at this laziness by Julius Randle. My goodness. Oh, my God, is that a lot of loafing. Again, you've got a man coming to double right here. So if you're guarding Kevin Durant, you have to get up and force him into this help. This player then rotates here. This player rotates up. This player rotates here. And the man that doubles falls here. Okay? But, again, you're sagging off him. He's going to shoot right over you. The Knicks don't know how to guard a down screen. Evan Fournier needs to get up and have his arms out so Kevin Durant cannot curl. Look when Kevin Durant curls. Look at the separation here. So now you have no chance of guarding this handoff, and it just leads to a wide-open Nets jumper. Can't run a ball screen defense that gives Seth Curry wide-open threes. Hedge. Get him out of here. Backside help right here on Ben Simmons' roll. This Knicks player can occupy these Nets players two passes away, but nope. Let's just give Seth Curry a wide-open three for fun. What is Evan Fournier doing here? He's guarding his man just fine. How are you about to just ball watch and fall asleep on your man? Now Evan Fournier's here. His man's all the way out here. So now it just he's going to be able to easily blow by him, and it's going to lead to help at the rim and a layup. Okay, you have to keep your back to the baseline like this. Look at this. When Kevin Durant cuts through, you're just sticking. You're seeing your eye, the ball and your man. As soon as you start guarding like this with your back to the sideline is when you're asking to get beat back door, and it's an and one. This is a god-awful gamble by Evan Fournier. Seth Curry has this ball. Look at when you don't get it. Now look what happens. Now this big's got to step up. This player's got to help the helper on the big's man, and the corner's now wide open for three. Jesus.